Hey sweetie, so this is going to be another brown eyes tutorial. Now, um, you can use this tutorial no matter what eye color you have, but these colors in specific tend to bring out brown eyes. And what I'm going to be using today is the NYX for your eyes only, and this is for brown eyes. And this is what the palette looks like. So let's go ahead and get started. Now this is more of like a toned down look. Um, something you can like wear to work or you know to school or whatever. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm using Painterly Paint Pot. And I'm going to apply this all over my lid. Up to the brow bone. And what this does it just brings out the colors a little bit more and it prevents them from creasing. We're going to be taking the low Cornell, but you can use any flat shader brush you have. And we're just going to start out with this green color right here. And we're going to start applying it in the middle of the eyelid and just bring it in slightly. We're not going to go all the way in because we're going to put a highlight color there. Now if you want to get really close to the lash line, all you have to do is flip your brush over and then just apply it to your lash line. And just pack the color on. And then we're going to flip it to the side and we're going to sweep it to kind of blend out the color a little bit. I'm going to take another low Cornell brush, but this is in fourth of an inch. It's really tiny. And we're going to go in with this color right here. And we're just going to apply this to the inner third of the lid. And bring it in and make sure to blend the two colors together. And then also bring it onto the lower lash line a little bit, only a third of the way. And this will just bring a little light to the inner portions of your eyes. Take a fluffy, bl um, fluffy blending brush and this is actually from Gotta Be Urban. I got this at Marshalls. And we're just going to take this color. It's like a light taupe color. And we're going to apply this right above the green color. So this is just going to be like a transition color from the green and then we're going to apply a dark brown in the crease. So this is just going to make things blend a little bit better. I'm just going to take a MAC 217 and we're going to grab this deep chocolate what brown. What we're going to do is we're going to start out here and just you can do um, you know you can tap the color on I'm just going to go in circular motions and slowly bring this into the crease. Now we don't want to bring it all the way in just where that highlight color be or ends. And we're just going to sweep in the color a little bit just to blend with the green. I'm going to go back to that other blending brush that we applied that taupe color with. And we're just going to blend this out. Now with that same brush, we're going to use that for the highlight also. And we're going to take this peach champagne color. 
and just dab your brush in there. We're just going to need a little bit, just the tip of it. And we're going to brush that on. It has some shimmer in there, so we want to be careful. Now we're going to be taking a pencil brush. I'm just using Sigma's 219. And I'm going to go in back with the green color and apply that to the middle portion of the lower lash line. Make sure to blend the highlight with the green. And we're just going to bring it in about just so there's an outer third left because we're going to go in with the brown and blend that in. To soften the lower lash line, I'm just going to go back with that fluffy blending brush and just run it along the lower lash line a little bit. What I'm going to do next is use my Maybelline Ultra Liner and line my upper lash line. And then for the water line, I'm going to be using Avon's Glimmer Sticks in Black is Black and apply some mascara. I'm using Avon's Shock super shock mascara and I'll be back okay sweetie so this is the final look it's somewhat natural just with a color a pop of color um, so on my cheeks I use max vintage grape and I just applied that as a blush and then for my lips I just used Rimmel's natural lip liner and just some basic gloss. I didn't even put lipstick on. So that's the look. And if you have any questions, just send me a message. Take care. Bye.